Hi and welcome to Newshi Sherman. Let's begin with a topic on Independence Day. Prime Minister Dr. Manmohan Singh unfurled the national flag at the Red Fort and Prime Minister Shant will make all efforts to see that people in the country can get the benefit of the economic progress of the nation. Dr. Singh spoke about bridging the gap between rural and urban divide. Prime Minister lauded the efforts of the farmers in giving the country a plentiful food surplus. He said that the government is making all efforts for the all-round development of the country. Dr. Singh said that government has taken steps to deal with deficit rains. These include giving diesel and seed subsidy to farmers in drought-affected areas. During a recent bomb blast, Dr. Singh said that the Pune incident points to need for much more work in the area of national security. And Dr. Singh says are capable to face any challenges. He said government is also taking all efforts to modernize the forces. And on Fort Singh promised to create confidence that there are no barriers to the investment in India. The Armed Forces and Security Personnel today kept a hawk eyed vigil over the capital to preempt. And President Pranab Mukherjee has cautioned against endemic protests against corruption, stating that the country would be flirting with chaos if its democratic institutions come under an assault. In his maiden address to the nation on the eve of the 66th Independence Day, Pranab Mukherjee underlined the dangers in undermining institutions like parliament and judiciary. Astronauts Sunit laid the tricolor on board the International Space Station yesterday and wished Indians on the eve of the 66th Independence Day. Take a look. To everybody in India and wish India a very happy Independence Day for August 15th. Um, there's been thousands of years of struggle to make India free and by the uh, great will and power of the people, and particularly Mahatma Gandhi, India has got its independence for the last uh, many years and uh, it's been a very productive, uh, wonderful country. I'm very proud to be part from India. My father, of course, is Indian from, from Gujarat. And when people ask me about India, what do, I, what do I think about? I think that it's a very colorful place, um, not only from the colors of the beautiful flag, but of all the people who are there. It is very uh, creative, colorful wonderful place and I'm very proud to be from there. So happy Independence Day to everybody in India. And now for a discussion on President and the Prime Minister. Professor Senior Mr. Alok Mehta, welcome to. With you just heard a while back Prime Minister addressing the nation on the 66th Independent Day and last evening Pranam Mukherjee, the uh, President also spoke to the nation about a host of issues that the nation has been witnessing so far. What have been your initial reactions to those speeches?